Hello, today I'm looking at an Acer Chromebook. This is model CB3-431. It's not charging. Um, when you plug the charger in, nothing happens. The computer is alive. It still has 13% remaining in the, on the battery, but um, it just won't charge. So have a look at the charger. My uh, multimeter lead doesn't fit in this connector. So I'm going to use a jumper lead. Interesting. It hits something in there. I wonder if that's the problem. Yeah, so there's voltage. I wonder if it's just not lined up properly. This, when I stuck that wire in there, I could feel it hitting something as if this is not centered anymore. No charge light. This feels quite loose. So I suspect the connector inside the laptop is broken. Although, ooh, this is shorty. Okay, so plugging the charger into this port, this port looks okay. But there's obviously a problem because plugging this connector into that charge port caused it to melt. Like the, the plastic got very hot and began to melt. You can see some of it sticking out here. I think that's plastic and not a wire. Yeah, it's just black plastic that's melted. So something is shorting inside the laptop. Whether that's the power connector or something else, I don't know, and I'm not exactly sure how I'll find out. I'm going to take the cover off and see what I can learn. Put the back edge toward me for consistency. I feel like this has been taken apart before. The bottom cases never come off this easily. Usually there's just, the tolerances are so tight that it's really difficult to get that off. That one came off quite easy. So, oops. charging port here. Looks like it's going to be relatively easy. I need to disconnect this battery. I always try to use plastic tools on these battery connectors. Um, I have to physically remove the battery because there's not really enough room to pull that, to disconnect that cable. There, okay. Battery's disconnected. So now this charging port kind of looks burnt, doesn't it? But that's the charging port. And it's, it looks not good to me. Um, I'll see if I can get it out of there. Looks like there's just one plastic clip holding it in. Ah. Boom. Okay. Nope, that's getting hot. Oh, yeah, okay. And it's not shorted there. So, safe to say, the charging port is bad. Let's see if I can get a new one. Okay, new power jack ordered. I'm just going to put this away and wait for the new one to arrive. I'm going to reconnect the battery, but I'm going to leave the power jack out 
because it's a bit of a fire hazard that was shorting out inside here and causing this to get so hot that it melted. So I'm a little bit worried about this. I'm going to talk to the owner. She says she has multiple chargers. I want to check to make sure that none of the other ones are melted. We might want to get rid of this one. But I'll reconnect the battery and put the cover back on for safekeeping so I don't lose any screws or anything. Okay, I'll be back when the new part comes in. Okay, the new part has arrived. It's longer, it's got a longer cord cable, but the connectors are identical on both ends. So red, red, black, black. All right, so let's do it. I think the hardest part of this is going to be finding a place for that extra cable, but actually there's there seems to be a lot of extra space here, so I think we should be okay. Now, which way does that go? The hole is offset slightly, so it makes sense that it would go like this. It needs to go under that hinge. Yeah. And looks like that lines up properly. This charger was damaged when it partially melted. The insulation inside partially melted. So I'm just going to, I'm going to test this before I put it completely back together. And yeah, that fits in there fine. So the old connector was like this with the black toward me. That blue ink was on the top. So black, black, red, red. So black black red red i think this connector would only go in one way anyway but I double checked to be on the safe side um yeah i'm not thrilled about that i might see about if i wrap this around this way yeah just took a twist out of it Put opposite twist into it and it seems fine there um, now, I'm going to test it before I put the cover back on. Got a charge light. I'm happy with that. I'm going to leave this plugged in while I do this. Why not? Yeah, it likes to... It fits quite tight on this side. But the battery is charging, and we're good to go. Thanks for watching.